of time. Anyway, here's our extra spicy take on the election. You get to hear about it from the most important, influential, politically savvy, and socially active group on campus, the marching band. The 2016 election began at a DJ mixer and ended in a Wayne single. It started, it started full of promising candidates, but ended with a delusional hermit and a shitty sink swamp. In the hazy morning after the election, we Colombians shuffled back home on our walks of national shame, wondering if we had thrombomoniasis or hepatitis oris. The outcome was worse than any Henry Moore statue we could think of. And like a shitty hookup, the election ended in a slammy panic at only one satisfied party. <laughs> It was clearly a cry for help from the attention whores of bumfuck nowhere America. An even louder cry for help than the Kanye West breakdown of 2016. These people claim they're getting fucked over, but are happy to do the same to minorities, which is the most hypocritical thing we've heard since using MLK to shut down black <laughs> Apparently, electing Trump was their only messed up way of telling the liberal elite, when you go high, we go as low as humanly possible. <laughs> Trump lost the popular vote campaigning that minorities ruined America, but he's wrong. There's only one minority ruining America, and it's his supporters. <laughs> this is probably the one time anyone will ever wish they were a freshman at Columbia, because they will be carried through this entire presidential cycle in Columbia's warm, liberal world. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.